Welcome to How To Dino. Today marks the day of a new series I'm starting, where I create video tutorials for your custom command requests. In this video, we will cover Mace Game's request to a waitlist command. Enjoy. Let's start by going to the Dino dashboard to add our custom commands. First, click on Manage Servers, next click the server you'd like to manage, and then click on the Custom Command tab, and add a command. The first command we'll add will be the Submit command. You can find the command code in the description. Let's take some time to explain what each of the variables do. Feel free to edit the command to your liking. The Delete variable will remove the command trigger message from chat. The Role variable will give the user running the command the waitlist role. Feel free to change this role to a pre-made role in your server. Do not remove the plus sign. The announce variable will send an embed to our specified channel. The embed will include the submission user and their proof. You are also free to edit the contents of the embed to your liking. The DM variable will private message the user the following sentence on screen. You are also free to customize the message to your liking. Disabling add everyone will prevent users from tagging everyone in the server using the custom command. This setting is optional. Now, scroll down to the advanced options and add one to required arguments. This will prevent members from sending blank messages. Finally, add the command. Now, let's add the accept command. You can use this command to remove the waitlist troll and add another. The custom command code for this is also in the description. The delete variable will remove the trigger message from chat. The silent variable will prevent Dino from sending the default role add remove message. The role variable will remove the waitlist role and add the member role. You are free to change these roles to your liking. The sentence beneath will be sent to the channel the command is executed in. Now, scroll down to permissions and set the allowed roles to a staff role. In this case, I'm only allowing moderators to use this command. Next, go down to advanced options and add a 1 to the required arguments. This ensures the command won't run when nothing is given. Let's configure our Discord server. First let's create a channel titled Submissions. This is where the embed messages will go. If you've set the custom command to send to a different channel, then you can skip this step. Next, let's create the waitlist role so Dino can assign it to users. If you've set the custom command to use a pre-made role, then you may also skip this step. I suggest the permissions for the submissions channel should be set to be viewed by staff members only for confidentiality. This is only a suggestion. Feel free to do what's best for your server. Follow the steps on screen to learn how to private the channel. Now let's test the commands. As you can see, the embed gets sent to the submissions channel, and a DM is sent to the user. In a moment, you'll see that Dino has also added the waitlist troll to the user. Once the accept command is executed, the user will lose their waitlist troll, and Dino will add the member role. If you're having issues with either of the commands, feel free to ask questions in the comments or seek help from the Dino support server. The server link can be found in the description. If you'd like me to make your custom command, send a request in the comments. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe.